He's been threatened over the phone, in emails, on social media. Apparently, there are bounties on his head. Now CNN has learned Darren Wilson is protected by a detail of off-duty police officers who've been by his side since the August shooting of Michael Brown. Fraternal Order of Police members from the surrounding area have volunteered and, and have provided him with security from that time uh, right up until the present. How long will you be doing this? We'll do it as long as we have to. Fraternal Order of Police Director Jim Pascoe says the off-duty officers are not being paid by Wilson or anyone else to protect him. Pascoe would not elaborate on the nature of the protection. It's likely very discreet. A low-key protection, not a marked unit in front of a house that draws as much attention as it may divert. Um, maybe one person, maybe two people, so that Officer Wilson, former Officer Wilson, can sleep at night. Wilson's lawyers say it's not just Darren Wilson these officers are protecting. There are threats out there not only against himself, but his family as well including Wilson's new wife, who is pregnant and on leave from the Ferguson police. One concern the attorneys and law enforcement experts have, efforts by hackers and others to track Darren Wilson down. There are cyber activists in our world who are going to be actively trying to find out where is Darren Wilson. They're going to be trying to find out where did Darren Wilson spend his last dollar so that they can track and put out in public where he is and, and really create an enhanced threat to him.